Hello everyone, I am back with the second video of my Christmas in July D-Stash series. This D-Stash is going to be a box of miscellaneous craft items, um, probably good for friend mail, junk journals, journaling, um, really any type of, of crafting that you do. I think there's a nice um, variety in here for you to use. Uh, let me go ahead and get started with what we have here. We have some new unopened sugar paper gift tags. Uh, these would be really cute for friend mail. These are some little butterfly um, clips. We have some gold chipboard tags and I think I used a couple of these but Looks like the majority of them are still left in there. Okay, some more paper clips. And then it looks like I did use a couple out of this package, but there's still a cute one left there. And some of this stuff I believe I had packaged up for craft swaps and friend mail, so um, that would be the reason why the paper clips are on this piece of craft paper. I just never got the chance to send it out. I actually had to stop doing craft swaps. Um, I just got too busy with other things, but I do hope to one day get back to doing those. Um, we have a little bag here of light green tags. I think I used a couple out of that. Here's a bag of chipboard tags. So I'm not sure how many's in here, but you will get a bag of those. I'm trying to go through this pretty quickly. There's there's um, a lot to go through, so I don't want to make this video too awfully long. Here we have some decorative accents. Um, I'm not sure if this is tissue paper, but um, some hearts. This has never been opened, so it looks like you can use them for a variety of craft projects. Here is a scrap pack, scrap paper that has never been opened. Uh, we have some more clips from Michaels. Okay, you will get three of these mini journals. I think they're called, yes, match, match booklets. So you will get three package of, packages of those. And there's two in each package. We have some iron-on crystals, and these are actually um, good for flower centers or really just embellishing any type of craft project. That's what I use them for, so you don't necessarily have to use them for um, ironing on. And here's here's the ones that I, I did open. Um, we have some Recollections copper-colored flowers, uh, I think. They're all here. It looks like I just took them off of the cardboard at some point, probably to try to store them better. But um, they are are all there. So you look at that. Then I have some wire edged ribbon. And that's the is it two inches, I think. And if I used any of this, I only used a little bit. I'm not sure if I even used it at all. I just I don't use wire edge ribbon this one is really nice animal print I may have used a little bit of that but um, most of it should still be on the roll here's some gold wire edged ribbon and pink and brown the little village scene on there I don't know if this is considered gold, gold or yellow. I think it might be a gold color. So and I don't believe I used any of that. This is a burgundy with gold um, little beads or little balls on there. And that is wire edge. That is brand new, never opened. Here's some gray 
um, polyester ribbon. I did use probably half of that. And then you get this entire package of glitter. I don't believe I used any of it. I'm not even sure if I opened it. So, and I think these things retail for about $20 or $30. So, you'll get that. Okay, so the rest of the items are in cello bags. And um, let me just move some of this over. I don't even remember what's in each of the bags. But um, I believe what I did was um, color code some supplies that I have. Like this bag here will be all red supplies. There's some paper clips, red tags, um, the little treat bags, smaller treat bags, um, more paper clips. I think there's note cards, um, different journaling cards, little tiny note cards, journal cards, tiny little envelopes, um, some cute little tiny folders and I don't know what these are called pockets I guess little tiny pockets so this is kind of a, a red theme I guess or it looks like I tried to put together a kind of a carnival type type theme you have some journaling cards there so that is one packet And here's some uh, chipboard pieces. It looks like a tag and some other little miscellaneous pieces in there that you could use on your crafting projects. Um, it looks like we have a pink bag here. Um, this one also has some of the um, treat bags, tags, envelopes. Um, I think these are little tiny envelopes, Meyer Road. Yes, I'm not even sure if I used any of those. Um, and we have just, I, I think, a lot of little tiny envelopes, note cards, journal spots, journaling tags. Um, oh, it looks like we have some little pink keys and um, clock pieces there. So just a random miscellaneous uh, mixture of different items. I have package to use as craft swaps and as you can see it just it did not happen. So there's the pink bag and then we have looks like some green colors here going to be the same thing just um, different uh, these are place cards so and they're great I believe I use some as um, journal spots they work great for journal spots we have some bows um, little craft or treat bags um, I probably saw some tags in here a little note card and envelope some tags so that's the green set and here's some more um, green colored items and I think this is for wedding stuff it says about her about him And with love so we get that this is new um, it has not been opened or used here are some black and white colored items we have some envelopes um, scrap papers and I think this is that gypsy gypsy seven some doilies some little coin envelopes um, oh a whole stack of the black and white um, Treat bags, and you can see it's just it's packed in there with black and white themed items. 
Then we have some pink and brown, some tags. There's a bunch of um, the tiny folders in there, which I've used to cut apart to make tags. So more folders, journaling tag. Um, looks like there's some bits of ruffle in there. Some pink doilies. And then we have a couple of bags here with some miscellaneous items in them. Um, some little envelopes, note cards, more of the little bags. And then we have another. Oh, this is nice too. It's it's very thick. It's not as thin as the treat bag there. It's very thick. And uh, looks like we have some more tags, little envelopes. These are adorable. And we have a little envelope there. Note cards, journal spots. Looks like we have a couple gold doilies. Um, let's see what's in the purple bag here. Okay. That's actually empty, but um, I'm going to go ahead and throw it in. I'm sure someone can use it. So this is it, and um, as you can see, there's a mountain of different supplies here. This is what you will get. Um, it will be shipped in a medium flat rate box. It completely fills the medium flat rate box, um, and this will be $22. It will be US only, PayPal only, and um, if you're interested in this lot, just um, Leave a message below and um, let me know if you're interested and I can send a PayPal invoice. I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks so much and um, stay tuned for more of my D-Stash Lots.